Hello everyone, in this short tutorial I will talk about uh, envelope tracking types for power amplifiers. Uh, this is a short tutorial and if you need more information please visit our website www.poweramplifier.net and I would greatly appreciate if you like the video and also subscribe to our channel. So let's get started. So there are two types of envelope trackers uh, which are most explored in literature at this point in time and the first is the LDO based envelope tracker this type of envelope tracker is uh, has good uh, bandwidth but it is not efficient so it's not much talked about as we speak right now and but the second uh, envelope tracker which is the evolution of the LDO based tracker is called a split stage envelope tracker and it is very commonly used in present day transmitter systems and Qualcomm is one of the company which has incorporated uh, uh, an envelope tracker in there. I see most likely it's a split stage, but again, we don't know about this. I, I don't want to speculate. But th this type is very heavily researched in academia as well as in industry. So a lot of patents are out there regarding split stage envelope tracker. Uh, so now we go into the trade offs of those two trackers, and then I will show the block diagrams of uh, those two trackers. So the major trade-offs uh, between the two, as I mentioned earlier, is that the LDO based tracker has more bandwidth, where the split stage is very challenging to design with high bandwidth. It does not have inherent high bandwidth. So LDO has a, a better performance in terms of wide bandwidth. The problem with LDO based tracker is it is less efficient and the split stage is efficient. We come to this in a moment. Uh, LDO based tracker is more linear and the split stage is more non-linear. Uh, this is because uh, uh, split stage uses switching mode power amplifier there. LDO based tracker is relatively easy to implement because it just consists of a linear amplifier and a feedback configuration and a power transistor. But the split stage is more complicated, it has more blocks involved. Another very important thing for LDO based tracker is that uh, it does not have an off chip inductor. Uh, but the split stage do have an inductor and this is a very important inductor uh, which is discussed in more detail in the website and LDO based tracker right now is not commonly used while the split stage is now commonly used both and explored a lot in academia as well as in industry. So these are the two schematics of uh, the, the block diagram uh, schematics of the uh, two types of envelope tracker. One is the split stage and other is the LDO based. So one can see in the LDO based it consists of an op amp in a feedback configuration and a power transistor. And the red color resistor shows the equivalent resistance of a power amplifier. The split stage envelope tracker is the evolution of the LDO based tracker. As you can see half of uh, it is exactly same as uh, the LDO based tracker but it has some other blocks which are like the hysteresis comparator, uh, the anti-shoot block, the, the power transistors and then it connects down to the power amplifier. So what it does is essentially it is a linearly assisted type of configurations. It means that the linear amplifier is assisted by a switching mode uh, buck converter or, or, a, or we can say switching mode amplifiers which uh, uh, divides in a way the bandwidth so the high frequency signal where low energy lies is amplified by the linear amplifier which is of course not very efficient and the low uh, frequency energy of the spectrum of the envelope is amplified by the switching mode amplifier and it does it very efficiently for very obvious reason when whenever you have switching there is a lot of uh, non-linearities which come into picture so we are getting efficiency in a split stage ET system, but we are sacrificing the bandwidth and also the, um, but mostly we are sacrificing the linearity. So, uh, but as I said, this is a highly explored topology. So definitely at the end of the day, right now, as we speak in the current wireless standards, and the split stage is a winner as compared to an LDO based record. More information I have discussed in the website, so please visit it and uh, uh, if you like this video, uh, uh, please like it and also subscribe uh, to the channel. Thank you very much.